Sharon Scholes. I'm a North East Victorian mother, wife and ultra distance runner. I currently hold several records for Australia and recently named the World Ultra Athlete of the Year for 2010. Ultra distance running actually means anything running over your normal marathon distance. So uh, 42 k's is the normal marathon distance. Anything over and above 42 k's is class classified as ultra. This stretch helps stretch through the quad um, and that helps the movement of the hips. And if you keep supple hips, then you can, you'll be able to run a bit further and a bit more comfortable. The this hour. is the 48 hour one. Yeah, um, this that is madness. We ran the entire duration of my birthday. So I spent my 34th birthday being weighted on hand and foot by That's my right. husband because, right. yeah. and my mother actually helped out at that event as yeah. my crew. Uh, every, a 500 metre lap um, on a dirt track and lots of blisters, lots of pain, but lots of satisfaction too at the mm. end. It's actually increased our communication lines and th that's been a positive effect on, on our relationship as well as um, general life. It's, it's good that he knows me so well yeah. and can um, adapt the training as well. So there are bonuses with, with having a coach that is so um, aware of, of where you are. He actually puts himself through a, a <laughs> bit of torture himself yeah, um, yeah. with regards to training. He's very similar in uh, his fitness, the pace we do. So he analyzes his performance and also correlates that with mine. So uh, it, it's interesting to see through the history mm. um, how we've developed as a team and the communication on during the running. He mm. tends, to, I've told him quite, quite naturally, he, I expect him to be a mind reader yeah. and I expect him to fix the problem. Yeah, <laughs> and I think a husband and somebody that's been with their, their partner for 20 years now um, probably has a better understanding and a better <laughs> ability to read minds than maybe the average person does. So mm. uh, it does work. Uh, I remember um, vividly in France last year at the World Championships where uh, Sharon came past on one lap and she said to me, I'm hurting fix it. That was it. That was all I got. And so I go back to my notes and I had a look at what she'd been eating and drinking and where she was and uh, came up with a, with a bit of a strategy. I think I might have given her some rice uh, pudding, which is one of her particular favourites deep into a long race, and told her to walk a half a lap. So she had the rice, walked half a lap, came back around the next time and said, yep, that worked. Yep. And off she went again and just kept running. No, she's terrific. Just terrific. Terrific wife, um, terrific athlete and I'm um, yeah, very proud of her, very proud of the relationship that we have. Yeah, no, it's true. Yeah.